It's time. Ain't that right, Peace? Let's go. Lou. Do one, one and a half. We're gonna do one, one and a half on the lap four now. So I want your body straight up. And I want you to bring it all the way down, come up a quarter, and then back down, and then go all the way up. Now, you're not really squeezing your back. You're squeezing the, lumb the lumbar. So you're blowing air out of your stomach, and then squeezing the lumbar, and then we're gonna contract the back from the bottom to the top. Instead of from the top to the bottom, we're gonna, go, we're gonna reverse it. So we're gonna do one, one and a half. Trying to get the upper, the upper back is gonna be the rear double bicep. Everybody's rear double bicep. Mm -hmm. What you're doing, and it's you automatically, yeah. yeah. Really so nice. so okay. I want to contract the lower lumbar so you get that lat to fall down, to make the waist yeah. appear smaller, so and get that detail all the way down. You're only gonna do that by contracting and squeezing on the lower lat. Once and once we get this part exhausted, every other movement is automatically gonna get turned. <laughs> Halfway up, blow out. That's it. Two more. <laughs> One more. That's it. Squeeze in. Come on, do it again. Four. Come on. Blow it out. Blow it out. Blow it back. Three last breath. Get the separation right through here, mm -hmm. right through here. Very good. Okay. This, see, this is supposed to be separate. It's not supposed to be two separate. Here. Exactly. Yeah. Because all this is trapeze, all through here. Rhomboids, posterior delt, that just the door sign, and this is the actual inner lat right here. It yeah. has to be separate. Yeah. Right here. All year round. Huh? Yes, sir. All right. So now what we're doing is now I'm changing. I'm putting the body in a different angle because I like that cobra style look. I like when the upper back, this other person's in sideways, I want the back to go in. I like a V taper from the front and from the side. That's it, that's it. Come on, roll it out here. No air in the stomach. So you the bottom and move. Squeeze. There you go. Come on. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Off the pad. Push it up. Use it. Push it against oh, the pad. Right there. Right there. Do that again. Come on. Push it against the pad. There you go. Get in. Come on. Come on. Good job. Good job. Elbows. Elbows. Yeah. Elbows. Good job. The lock guard tower, see? See, there you go. Oh, see? Yeah, we same height now, baby. Now we're gonna grab it out on the end and let your elbows go behind your body. Now the reason we're doing it on here, instead of standing, I can take the pressure off the lower back and still get the lights in there. Come on, bro. This is cool. Mm. Pull the elbows back. Pull the elbows back. Like that. Right here, right here, right here. Right there, come on. Come on, there you go. Come on, stretch. Pull it back. Pull it back. Good job, good job. It's pretty cool. It's a different one. Really feel it though. It's really back right there, there, yeah. So that you're, you really get that crease. From the back, yeah. Down. Now lean back, now lean back. Chris, see how in the back double, in the back double, you have it actually kicks his glutes out, right? Mm -hmm. And then in the in the lat spread, you have him put his glutes right, right, forward. forward. Uh -huh. So in both poses, I always do it glutes up. But do you think that 
is there a benefit? Do you think, depending on the physique? It's been a know, should, but, but let me tell you what it is. So let's go and start the Christmas tree. So what I like to do, I like to stretch the skin as tight as possible. Right. Now he stretches his skin as tight as possible. Now he's blowing out of his stomach, mm -hmm. and then he's bringing his hand back low. And then, no, 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 he lost, he lost, he lost. Stay forward. Just tight, just tight. Stay forward. Now here, go. On. Everything you got on this one. Right there. there now bring go. him up, blow out again, and now yeah, open it. Now do. open it. Go ahead. Now crunch down. Hips forward and lean back here. Oh, so you're, stre you're stretching the skin. What I'm doing, skin, I'm stretching the back wider. Okay. So if, if now if he stands straight up, stand straight up. The back is short. If I go like this, punch over and then lean back from the hip, the back is actually wider. Right. I said more big of a canvas like that. Okay. Rear double. Now we got a little subcutaneous water here, but when as he's blowing out here, he's squeezing here. Mm -hmm. But this is gonna be real nasty. It's sort of separation yes. like that. Now here, here, open it, open it, open it, open it, and go. now bring it yeah. back, lean back, right here. Nice. Now you see how the whole back right from doing like this is all thick right here, it's thick, it's thickness right through here. The, the posterior date is always, is always going to be prominent, so I'm able to bring it forward to even it out through here. And I'm trying to fill in this valley because most bodies have a shallow middle back. Right. Yeah. That's why all the movements are focusing into there. Mm -hmm. Rest. Is that under the lights is going to look three? Right. right. You know, little alternate grip, going to grab on top, full range of motion. And get a full extension. Now, what he's doing, and he's pulling back, he's pushing against the cycle he's pad. He's trying to hit it different. He's Maybe. pushing against the cycle pad, and then he's squeezing his arms. Shit. Come on. These on Amazon? Push against this way. I got Prime. There you go. Slow it down. Slow it down. No explosion. No explosion. Oh, drop, drop the hip down. So, see some. Drop the hip. <laughs> Open, open, come on. Open. Good job. Looks good. Looks good. There you go. <laughs> mm. I can feel this through my heart. Mm. I feel it from top to bottom. Yeah. Come on, come on, all the way down. Come on. That's come on. it. Come Slow, on, man. Got like four days left. Come on. That's it. That's it. Want to the right Hit that back. That's good. Nice. Right there. Good shit. Three double. Slow down. Squeeze, squeeze. Good job. Ben? Alright, cool. That wrapped up our back workout with here Mr. Regan Grimes. Came all the way from Canada to train with the young the young Thundercats. So let's go around the thing and you guys can find out how they thought the session went and what they learned from it. All right, Lou. Yeah. yeah. I learned a lot from um, uh, <laughs> <laughs> the guys. <laughs> 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 yeah. Learned awesome. some training tips. Um, yeah. yeah. That's awesome. yeah. Right. You went five days, four days out. Yeah. Four days out. Yeah. It's four crazy. days out. I, it's your first one. Right? Second, second one. Second one. Second one. We're gonna be doing the Excalibur on the 13th. Uh, today I did pick something up from today. As much as we train with Cycle, uh, training with you know a, a pro bodybuilder, just watching the squeeze more. Cause Zeke was talking trash to me, like, yeah, he squeezes every <laughs> single rep. <Yeah. laughs> so learning how to squeeze every yeah. single rep, there was a difference in the way you work out versus mm -hmm. you know just throwing weight around. So you know, respect the weights. You trying to say we throw weight around when Regan isn't here? No, what are you no, no, no. Cut, cut, what the hell? What the hell? Oh, well, we're on our best behavior. No, what he's trying to say is it's always good to see how a professional bodybuilder actually moves the weight opposed to 
Winky Dink amateurs that are ready for program. <laughs> I throw the weight around some. I do, and they always tell me, slow down, control the weight. They do. I do. So you gotta learn how to get muscle separate. All right, next person. <laughs> All right, I'm also four days out doing the Excalibur with Terrence, a uh, different division. I'm doing classic. Um, awesome to train with Regan. Uh, it's, it's just nice being able to be surrounded by people that are already where I hope to be one day. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's always an honor to train with pro bodybuilders. Yeah, yeah. Pee -pee. I'm John Bajic, ça fait six mois que je m'entraîne avec Chris, avec uh, Zim, Terrence, Lou. Aujourd'hui, j'ai eu la chance de m'entraîner avec Regan, il vient du Canada. Ici, je commence ma préparation pour uh, 14 semaines avec, uh, avec Striker. Et c'est une expérience de, de dingue. J'ai fait quatre uh, compétitions en Europe en main physique et je vise uh, le classique physique. Chris. Can you translate in Spanish? Yeah, yes. I know I got that. Awesome is, uh, awesome is psycho, is what he said. He's the best trainer in the world. He knows everything. He's coming up with all the new movements. People love him. He's good to women, children, and animals. And he knows it all. I heard, by the I heard something about the psycho pad in there. Too. Oh, and the psycho pad is $199. $199. Get yours today. Now, that's the good awesome. thing about it. When you ever get the pros coming in and give, you know, when you, when you get to the top, it's always best to reach down and yeah, it's a lot of fun and pull the guys up and stuff like that and sharing information and throwing ideas around is what makes us all better. And yeah. we we'll thank Regan for coming out. Yeah, thanks, thanks for, for having me, guys. Yeah, always great. Yeah, young, good energy. It's always a good vibe, you know. It's always have fun too while we're doing it, you know. Yeah. So, yeah, so good.